Cascade Sports. I'm Marlon Rollington. We're here at Lee Summit West where they just defeated the Ruskin Eagles. Right now I have the head coach of the Lee Summit West Tigers, Michael Sheber. How's it going, coach? Not too bad. Feel pretty good after a win tonight. Tough conference team and kids came out ready to play tonight. So, you know, it's a rough little stretch for us here, making up some snow games. It's, gonna, it's our uh, fourth game and in uh, six days. Tomorrow will be our fifth game in seven days. So uh, it was good to get a, a comfortable win tonight. Coach, you, uh, you guys led pretty much since the second half by 20 points. Uh, the final score was a little over 20 points. What was the game plan coming into this game? Attack the post. You know, we were counting the number of post touches that we got. We felt like we had a pretty good advantage in there. Um, and the kids did a good job of executing it. You know, I think we counted 11, 13, 14 and nine in the last quarter that we had post touches and we scored on a lot of them. I mean, it was just guys getting a good position, guys feeding the post. And again, you know, we tried to preach to the kids, you know, it's about winning. It's not about who scores, it's about winning. And, and I thought the kids did a good job of being unselfish with that tonight. Coach, how would you describe your team style of play? I think we're up tempo, like to get out and run, like to, like to defend the entire floor. You know, so when we're able to get defensive stops, deflections, those types of things, we find we're more successful than when we just kind of stay back. Great, great. Um, tell us about the gentleman of the team and the, what kind of chemistry. Yeah, this, he's, this group of kids really likes each other. You know, I mean, I think it's been rough on them because, you know, with the snow last week, we were off for four days, no practice, and, you know, that's kind of like a second winter break. It's a little bit tough to come back from. We really haven't had a practice practice. You know, we've got to get after it in probably three weeks. You know, so we've just had these games have just piled up on us. But again, we're looking forward to get through this week. Tough opponent in Rockhurst tomorrow, tough opponent at Truman tomorrow, or excuse me, Friday, and then getting into next week where we can get back to a little regular schedule. All right, Coach, are, there, are there any schools that you look forward to playing against? Well, I mean, I, again, any conference school that we play against, and, you know, Rockhurst is a district foe, so having to go against those guys tomorrow night kind of gives us a measuring stick of where we are within our own district. You know, we want to win our conference tournament first, that, that two-game stretch where you're playing one home, one away against everybody. We kind of see that as a mini tournament and uh, putting ourselves in a situation to win that tournament and then putting ourselves in state play, trying to make a run. We'll see what happens. What's up, Kansas City? I'm Brianna Garlington. I'm Charles Williams. And I'm Derek Parker. And we are CMG. And we would like to welcome you to follow both websites. That's whatsupkansascity.net and cascadesports.tv. Some of our programs consist of Are You Awoke, Coach's Corner, and many more interviews, news, and blogs. Be sure to like our Facebook page and follow us on Instagram at Cascade Media Group and Twitter at What's Up KC and Cascade Sports. And remember, the victory we call success goes to the best prepared. And when you invest in your community, you are really just investing in yourself. So don't just like it, share it.